Hey guys, on today's video, we're gonna be updating your Mac, so let's get started. So first of all, it doesn't matter which Mac you guys have, this is the video for you. So let's just get started. Right away, what you guys have to do is go on the top left-hand side of your screen, you're gonna see the Apple logo, click on it, then System Preferences, second option. Once that pops up, you should see Software Update as your first option. If you don't, don't worry about it. Go down, go into General. Under General, your second option should say Software Update, tap on it. And then from here, this should be popping up. Now let's say nothing's popping up for some reason. Just turn on and off beta updates. Also automatic updates, just play around with that. That should refresh your Mac in order to see the latest Mac update. So this is it. And we can update it tonight, update it right now. Obviously this is about updating right now. Uh, we're just gonna tap on update now. We're gonna see this agreement popping up. Just tap on agree, put in your password. Tap on OK, and it's gonna download the update. So this will be the latest update for your Mac, and it shouldn't take that long, because it's not a huge update. That said, if you guys have a MacBook, make sure to have it charging while you're doing this. Even if it's 100% of your battery, always have it charging while you're making any update. Something I usually do is also uh, going to Time Machine and make a backup there that it's gonna back up your entire Mac. That's something that's already installed on your Mac, by the way, I have a different video for that, but that's something I suggest doing. Now this updates around six gigs, so it does depend on your internet speed, how fast this is. Now the installation time shouldn't take more than 10 minutes. That's if you have an older Mac, but when it comes down to downloading time, well, again, that depends on your own internet speed. Now at this point in time, you could just leave your Mac to be and it's just gonna restart by itself. So later on, you should see a black screen, Apple logo loading bar, and then you're gonna be done with the update. So like I mentioned, just leave your Mac to be, it's gonna restart by itself and then come back to it afterwards. All right, so if you left your Mac to be, like I mentioned before, you would have seen it restart, Apple logo loading bar, and then two screens where you guys just have to click away and then you would be done. So you guys can check out if everything went okay, just by software update. And you guys can even check again, check for update. And then you should be okay. But as far as this video goes, we are all done. We have the latest update installed already. And that would be it. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you.